And I'll see you. Let me know. Call, I'll call you whenever I'm, uh, I'm done, okay? Here, let's go slacks. Still... Have a good one, sirs. Have a good one. Have a good one. You good, slacks? Mm. Need, Goodbye. Need something. Goodbye, Goodbye Miss Jones. Good to see you. Bye. I don't got keys. That's, that's odd. Maybe I dropped them during the chain gang pursuit. I can open this door. It's all you. All right. I feel like we need to be in the therapy chair, Slacks. What's going on? Justin DeMarco. Uh, let me close this door. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He died I'm last sure night. Relevant. Someone's planted yeah. an American flag up there. Okay, it calls me up today. Angry about the news. Have a, have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. Come on. Of course. Angry about the news. About what happened. And obviously saying that I'm the reason why he died because I took his keys away after July the 3rd. I went on to explain that he was dishonest. Then he showed transparency. I wasn't trying to charge him. I just wanted the truth. If I don't work with the criminal informant, rule number one is trust and honesty. Because if it's not mm -hmm. built on that, then we cannot work together. And on top of it, if you're going to be involved in an incident where you're shooting my fellow cops, I cannot work with you. I draw the line there. You want to shoot cops? We're not working together on that kind of level basis. Yeah. So, we had an agreement. He turned over the house key over. He was ready. He told me he was ready for his life. It wasn't time to hide. I understood it. It was more like him leaving the nest. And then with him dying... I'm getting the blame. Okay. How did the autopsy come? He was ran over. Vehicle homicide. Mm. You can see the autopsy report if you like. It's in the reports in there. Yeah, I'll check it. I didn't even know uh, he was missing. He got his keys taken. I, I did see him on the list of people that were uh, at the July 3rd thing, though. Yeah. That was after that. I mean, I think I mentioned it to y'all. I don't know if you recall or not. Remember when we had the whole thing about it? Maybe. But, um, it, I mean, it's, it's tough to hear. Sheriff. Does he have any family that we've contacted? Uh, contacted? I tried to reach out to Beatrice. Nothing. I don't know if Beatrice even existed. I believe she did. I tried. I'll try again today. Well, I mean, obviously... Okay. Um, I'm just, um, listen, I don't know how to say this and I'm coming to you because you are the sheriff because I fully trust in you and that's why I came to this department. Okay. He said something to me that just, um, I didn't know how to process. He said, this will go on until you put down the badge and we have our dance. Uh, okay. I'll, uh, I'll talk to Kay. And just listen to him. See what he, see what, where he's standing in all this. He's gonna kill more people. He's already killed, f he, he's well, already hurt five. To, get him to, to not go that route. I tried. He said, you think I'm stupid? You think that low of me? I'm going to keep doing it until you put down the badge. And I'll be honest, Sheriff. I don't know how I can function. Knowing people are getting hurt because of me. And I know I can stop it by one action. Like, how selfish of me to just Stay on duty. And not try to confront this man. Because if this does not stop, more people are going to get hurt. And more people are going to get hurt. Let me talk to him. 
Um, and I figure, I figure where, where, why he's thinks it's your fault, and and why they're going down this path of violence and. Because of Justin, yeah. because we took the house keys, because I should have kept him. I should have kept him in my in the house. But how long? You cannot protect somebody forever. And he was ready. We, we were ready for the next step. It's not like I just pulled it beneath his feet. I didn't pull the rug beneath his feet. This was a, a mutual conversation over time that developed. It, it's unfortunate how it ended. But I'm not trying to get the guy killed. I still, I still feel bad about what happened. I mean, taking the house keys, I knew the consequences. I knew that was more vulnerable. Yeah. But how can you help somebody who's not willing to help themselves? I mean, he's been saying he wanted to be out there and just take it on forever. It was like, he, it was like he knew it was just a, t a ticking time clock. Huh? Whether he was in that house or not, I, I don't, I don't know. I I don't know much about the the specifics of what happened last night or anything leading uh, to it, but uh, sheriff, I'm I'm coming to you. That um, I don't know if an LOA or maybe. I don't know. I don't want to. I don't want to go there. Hour. Okay. I don't want to go there yet. Mm -hmm. But that's kind of where my head is at. Thinking, how can I do something about this, right? Because he's gonna try to turn everybody on this narrative. I understand. By I by understand. by attacking more people and saying, you know what, you want to blame I, somebody, I, blame that guy right there. I I understand, but if it's not you, it's the next person. Select. But I can stop this right now. I want to hear him out and see why he's targeting you. I don't want you to make this decision too early. Um, without just, just let me hear, let me hear what's going on. Okay. Okay. As, All right. as soon as I finish number? talking with them. Oh yes, I do. Okay. Keep me updated right. because I'm losing my mind over time. I will. Sheriff, I trust you and I appreciate your help. I love you slacks. Hey, I'll try my best. Do everything I can. I'm going to go down downstairs to go join them in the city, the, the okay. hospital. Let me know. Okay. Oh, it's awkward. You might have to let me out. I don't got keys. Okay.